so cool. Welcome back. Halloween may be tomorrow, but there's still time to decorate your pumpkins without messing around with the mushy guts and potentially dangerous carving tools as yeah. well. Some of us have waited too long to make that pumpkin into a jack-o'-lantern. A little late, but you can still <laughs> spice up your pumpkin and have fun with the kids while doing it. That's right. Sarah Vanderkoy is a blogger at Creative Ramblings, and she is here with some last-minute no the arm car up. pumpkin ideas. There yeah, she is. And she is Rosie the Riveter. <laughs> Welcome to the Morning <laughs> Glen. <laughs> that's awesome. Yeah. Well, nice I, to have you here. Yes, thank you so much for having me. I am sharing some really simple last-minute pumpkin ideas that anybody can do. Mm -hmm. You can do these with real or fake pumpkins, and you probably already have these supplies at home. Okay, okay. So that the first, sounds good. Yeah, exactly. You don't have to run out and do too much. Mm -hmm. The first one I want to show you are thumbtack pumpkins. Um, now, I'm I using fake pumpkins here. Okay. Um, I picked these up earlier this week for 70% off. So if you're headed home from work today and you pass a craft store, you're going to get these at a really deep discount. Because well, okay. tomorrow. Exactly. <laughs> the Halloween's yeah. tomorrow. Yeah. So Look at how beautiful yeah, this okay. is. So these are just silver tacks. That's all they are, just silver tacks. This one's thumbtacks. unfinished, so you can mm -hmm. see how she drew on the, the B-O-O, -O, and then this is the unfinished spot. I was going to ask if you drew it, because yep. for me, I would never accomplish <laughs> that with just oh, freehand. No, no, you draw it on, and it's just, if you want to try it, it's just really easy. Get a shot. Hold on, let me just see if we mm -hmm. can, we're able to see that. Okay, yeah, twist yep. that a little bit. Okay, yep. so it's drawn on, and then yep. you just follow... Follow the line the and line. push in your tack. It's that simple. Yeah, do another one. That's, That's fantastic. Cool. And Honestly, this is so much safer. I mean, mm -hmm. tax, you probably still want to keep away from the little, little kids. Mm -hmm. But if you've got, you know, a five-year-old well, enough, you may very well off, be able huh? to do okay. this without any, you know, worrying so right? much about getting the cutting tools out. Exactly, Ooh. exactly. A little bit older kids, but they there. can get involved and get really creative. We did Ooh. a spider web, boo. And like I said, these are faux pumpkins. Save these for next year, and then they'll save yourself some time. And it's beautiful. So I mean, like, pretty. this is yeah. really pretty. You're going to so. make a statement at your Halloween party. Absolutely. What else can mm -hmm. I thumbtack? That's right. right. Yeah. There's, There's, a lot lot of things. Things. There's a lot of things you can thumbtack. Pretty cool. <laughs> so you can do it on real pumpkins or fake yep, pumpkins. It works on either, either one. Either one. That's a great mm -hmm. last-minute idea. This one's really cool. So this is glitter pumpkins mm -hmm. with mini ones. A lot of people just get the little ones, especially this late in the game, right? Yes, exactly. And these make a great centerpiece, too, mm -hmm. and they're, they're so simple. Um, my daughter likes to say uh, glitter Cute. makes everything better. It does. And it, it kind of does. <laughs> um, and so this would be a great display for a Halloween party is. tomorrow. We've got a green and gold one up front that you could leave with your snacks oh, on yeah. Sunday. Um, so you can leave them up for a little while. But this is as simple as taking just some school glue and then sprinkling some gl glitter right on top. Any design so you want. Get the whole family involved, too. The kids can play around with the glue. They're not going to hurt themselves, maybe make a mess. But So you kind of yeah. draw what you want on with the glue. Uh -huh. In that essence, you're still drawing, too. Yes. So you could do the Green Bay Packer logo on that guy. You absolutely could. There oh, we go. Well, maybe yeah. you could. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Where did you get these? Just any craft store Any again? craft store, yep. Okay. And a lot of the big box stores are starting to carry more and more craft supplies, too. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. you can find these just about anywhere. Yeah. All right. Yeah, you now, could probably even get these mm -hmm. at a, yeah, a little drugstore or something. Yeah. Paint her Pumpkins. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I've never actually delved into the painting pumpkins because painting makes me nervous. I'm probably the thumbtack <laughs> girl. But <laughs> what what uh, what did you? Uh, obviously, this is mm -hmm. beautiful. Um, whatever drawing on here, you've mm -hmm. had to have drawn this first, right? Uh, I did, yep. Again, I used pencil on this one. And mm -hmm. a few tips for painting a pumpkin, you probably already know, but start with a clean and dry pumpkin. Mm -hmm. um, you can wash them, put them in your sink, a little soap, and make sure they're nice and dry. And then I just drew that on with a pencil. Um, now, I don't have very good handwriting, so I just um, typed up a nice font in the document and like eyeballed it back and oh, forth, yeah. drew it on, and then painted over just with black paint and a really um, fine-tipped paintbrush. Yeah. Um, and you can make anything you want on those. You can get really elaborate or, you know, just some letters. So cute. There's um, there's really cute ideas online, too. A lot of people have mm -hmm. seen things on Facebook or mm -hmm. whatnot. Um, my boyfriend picked out pumpkins uh, with his little one that they're painting the minions on. Oh, yeah. Oh. It's just like you get, like, the top of, a, of an empty jar, uh -huh. and uh -huh. those are the eyes. Yeah. And then you paint them yellow and the blue. Oh, and cute. It's mm -hmm. really cute. Really yeah, you cute. you can get really creative with yeah, it. Yeah, and all that stuff. You can, like you said, it's stuff around the house, just mm -hmm. get some paint, and it's not all the dangerous stuff. Yeah. Do you, so what makes you like into uh, into all the decorating stuff? Do you just love doing, I know you've got this great blog mm -hmm. that we're going to put up in a second. I have a passion for crafting. I mm -hmm. always have, and uh, I started Creative Ramblings to really share that passion with my readers. I share step-by-step -step tutorials, videos. I really want to help people create at home. Mm -hmm. um, I don't want this to seem overwhelming to anybody. Yeah, this um, was easy. Yeah, yeah, they really are, and you can, you can really impress your friends and yeah. make it look like you spent hours, but 
five, ten minutes on these, and you've got some great crafts. Look like Martha cool. Stewart without having to dress up like her. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Exactly. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's true. So creativeramblingsblog.com mm -hmm. is where you share these tutorials and yes. more. Yes. And do and you do this for every holiday as well? Every holiday, every season. Um, Halloween is big right now. That's what people are searching mm -hmm. for on Pinterest. So that's what I want to provide my readers. But I'm starting with Christmas stuff already. So Good. Um, yep. So there's all kinds of tutorials out there. You can find me on YouTube, Facebook, Pinterest. And um, you can find a lot of these other tutorials too. These cute mummies and candles. Oh, and yeah. We'll show we didn't even show these. the mummy. Look at this. That's this is so adorable. adorable. Awesome. Just a jar with some gauze, mm -hmm. little little uh, what are they called? Little googly eyes. Little googly eyes. Googly if you eyes. have ten minutes and some gauze at home, you can make this tonight. That is so cute. <laughs> can you put a little fake candle oh, in yeah. there too? Yeah. Oh, I put a real candle in there oh, too. Really? It's glass. Yeah, Perfect. it's not going to hurt anything. Uh, Sarah, you're mm -hmm. the best. Thanks so much. Thank you. Appreciate it.